Okay. Shut up. Today's July 17th. Gonna do a little garden update here. Uh, these tomato vines, tomato plants are looking uh, fairly bare, other than the uh, other than the uh, <coughs> Tommy toes here. But that's simply because I've picked them all. <coughs> and they're getting to the point where they're about played out. These aromas here, I don't know if you can see those. But uh, the tomatoes, I am uh, I'm buried. I, I literally am buried in tomatoes. I've had so many. and Basically every Saturday, I can. That's all I do. I can. That has become my life. Uh, one thing I'm ashamed of is my, uh, my okra. Okra ought to be shoulder high by this point. Mine's about a foot tall. And I planted it, you know, early June, I guess. Oh, it was late May. Yeah, late May I planted it, but uh, it's terrible. It looks awful. <clears throat> cucumbers, they didn't do anything. I, uh, I need to do a lot more research on cucumbers. Terrible. Uh, my weed bed, I mean onion bed, uh, it, it's done really well. It looks terrible now, but uh, I've gotten a lot of onions. There's still a lot in the ground I'm going to pick out tomorrow, and let them start curing. Uh, I've got some uh, sunflowers here. First year I've ever grown sunflowers, so I don't know if they're doing good or not. These are some uh, terrible Tennessee volunteer. Uh, these are bar fight volunteer uh, tomato plants. There's a couple romas, and then you can see here some of the uh, yellow pears. <clears throat> We've got a few off of it, but this this has definitely not been the uh, the ones. I mean, we've we've not needed any, so uh, we've not really worried about it. In uh, the few garden videos that I've done this year, uh, you might have seen that uh, this was a potato bed, and it only went to. Let me see about right here but I've tilled it on up and now I've planted corn and I know it's hard to see but it's about two inches tall now it's a golden queen never planted it before so I'm anxious to see how it does uh, this row here it's hard to tell the height but uh, that's my peanuts peanuts and they're probably, I don't know, two and a half feet tall. They're doing real well. I, it's hard to mess up a peanut. Uh, green beans, pretty much played out. I got uh, about 16 quarts canned off of this uh, 27 foot spread. Uh, not to mention, you know, eating green beans several meals. So, uh, that's been pretty cool. Done really well with the green beans. Green beans and tomatoes, and of course onions and garlic, uh, have been our, uh, main meals. These are my, uh, yellow squash. You can see one right there. They've, uh, they've done okay. I, I've, I don't eat a whole lot of squash, so this was well more than, than I needed. Uh, this is plum grannies. I've, I've let this get overrun with weeds. It's terrible. Uh, I should be ashamed, but I'm not. Uh, I am ashamed that I've not done more videos. I apologize. But you can see down in there, there's some plum grannies. And uh, if you look back at one of my videos, one of my videos called uh, Tennessee Jeff on location or something, I go over to my brother's house. And uh, he grows plum grannies, and my grandfather used to grow plum grannies. And they're just a uh, aromatic, sweet-smelling 
uh, gourd, I guess is the best way to describe it. But uh, well, that's all they do. They just smell good. I don't think you can eat them. Uh, but I've already got a couple that I've uh, harvested, and, and sure enough, they, they smell really pretty. And at least I've got seeds now for next year. <clears throat> but uh, so right now, uh, the corn is the uh, is my main focus. I've got uh, four 38 foot rows, which you know that's small scale for you real farmers, but. Uh, it's the most I've ever planted. Matter of fact, uh, where my tomatoes are this year is where I planted my corn last year. And uh, I don't know, uh, I think it was 25 foot rows last year. So I got more this year. But uh, that's where we're at. Uh, like I said, buried in tomatoes, buried in uh, green beans, uh, okra, sad disappointment, although part of the reason is uh, planting it here behind the uh, <clears throat> the tomatoes. My son uh, pretty much goes, uh, let's see, basically parallel. This is, this is south, so... These the, the okra is pretty much getting shaded out the entire day, not to mention these trees pretty much shaded out in the in the afternoon. But uh, that's where we're at. Uh, it's 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 been a very good year, but uh, some disappointments. But anyways, thanks guys.